Hello everyone, welcome to Explaining Teach, Tutor, Train. Today we'll be explaining the channel production using TurboTax. To begin, let's go ahead and sign into our account using the sign in button on the top right corner of the screen. Now this is assuming you already set up an account with TurboTax. After signing in, you will arrive at this page. Enter your username and password. You must choose the itemized option when filing your taxes in order to be able to deduct charitable donations. Once on this page, select the orange button in order to continue working on your tax return. Here, we will use our search option in the top right corner of the screen. After typing in itemized deduction, we are able to select the option within the list of results to jump to that screen in the TurboTax software. In this case, we are skipping directly to the itemized deduction page. Once on this screen, the quickest way to complete your tax return without the access tutorial built in the TurboTax software is to select the option under I will explore on my own. This page gives you the list of allowable deductions and credits if you decide to do the itemized deduction. Now, find charitable donations section and select any of the three options as applicable. If you have an It's Deductible Online account, you may choose the first option, then select Yes to continue. In this case, we have no data available, so we will select the back button and select the second option. Now let's try the second option. Make the selection on this screen as applicable. On this screen, we enter the name of the charity organization. Then we enter an option that fits our donation. In this example, close. On this screen, we are given the option to choose. In this example, we wish to go directly to the page where we will begin entering the required information. Here, we enter the date that the donation was given. On this screen, we will select the first category since we are using close as the donation in our example. Here, we enter close in the first space. The value of the close donated in the second and how the value of the clothes donated were assessed. Select done at the bottom right to continue. On this page, TurboTax gives us a summarized snapshot of all donations entered in the system. You have the option to edit or delete as necessary. You may also add additional donations as applicable. Select done with charitable donations if all donations are accurate. TurboTax will now explain charitable limitations in amount percentage of adjusted gross income and the charitable limits per type of organizations as shown. Make your selection as applicable. Select continue to go back to the list of deductions and credits. As you scroll down, you will notice deductible amounts shown under charitable donations. Now, if you have any carryover donations from the previous tax years that exceeded the allowable charitable donations for those years, you have the option to carry over the excess charitable donations to current tax year until the amount is depleted. Select the charity carryover option. Select Yes. Now, enter the amount applicable to each year given. Respond to the questions that follow as applicable, and after you are finished entering the required data, you will be brought back to the list of deductions and credits.
Today, we explain how to itemize charitable donations using TurboTax. Remember to subscribe and check out our other videos. Thank you.